Hello and welcome back. <clears throat> Sorry to um, Baldur's Gate 3. We are neck deep in a goblin camp and we're exploring to our heart's content. Um, there's a bunch of things we can do over here. Let's. Uh, I know I said I wasn't going to lead with the steering, but he does have to lockpick, so he may as well do this. Uh, I said I said a steering. Let's go. Shift S. Shift C. Oh, 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 never mind. Who is, who is that? Okay. I'll pick. Uh oh. <clears throat> Let's just do it with his basic stats. They're good enough. Okay, we're all just gonna be cool, be cool. Um, you know, group up a little bit. Um, we're just keeping an eye on the, on, okay, let's just wait for this guy to, hiding successful. That's, that's not really what we want. And go. Go, 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 go. It's fine. Close the door. So what do we got in here? Anything cool? Not seeing anything good yet. Those water barrels. A quick rummage. <laughs> I like the way he says that. A quick rummage. Um. We've got something interesting over there, but no way in hell can I make that jump. I don't know, maybe we can, but I'm not gonna try just yet. Sure, I'll take the silver tray. We're just gonna, you know, take everything that's not bolted down. All right, do your thing, Asterion. Total bonus plus eight. We almost can't fail that. Aha. Uh -huh. Where is this? Defiled Temple. Bodyguard of the High Priestess. Everyone's rolling critical fails. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to do this with Asterion. He's just the best candidate. Ooh. So we've got some iron gates over here. What do we got going on in here? Anything good? I'm gonna try and get over here real quick. Okay, we're gonna do this one at a time. One at a time. Is Lazil still broken? Yes, she is. Why is she broken? Continue. Stop being broken. All right, I'm gonna quit and save. I'll be right back. Okay, it's just uh, she Lazil is no longer broken. It's dawned on me that actually there's a better way of getting to that spot over the over here We can go over here And I might even be able to jump through this thing Not a single act wasted. No, stop stop it stop it. Please cancel You've wandered into a forbidden area. Oh, you I really wish you could cancel your leave. actions. I'm actually gonna load this because that that is complete garbage what just happened there Because I listen i'm sure that what that was leading to is all fun and, and everything but I i'm not going to live with the consequences of a misclick i'm afraid That uh that that's just really frustrating 
I thought that maybe she could jump through that thing and then, um, you know, be out outside of the line of sight. But it didn't. It didn't work out that way. All right, let's try this again. Not one false move. No one else is very good at. Oh God. Please, please hide. Please, please be hiding. Not one false move. Okay. Let's do this the right way. Uh, none of this is very good. I shouldn't have done this. Why can't I go through this little thing here? Hold on a second. Cat, you are uh, otherwise a joy, but you are making life difficult for me. Okay, yeah, um, none of that is what I want. set foot in a restricted area okay so that just doesn't work exit may be in order um trying to convince them that you belong here intimidation this is my place now if you don't leave you won't leave at all total bonus we don't we don't have a good bonus against this and uh <laughs> shadow heart isn't with us so we can't have guidance Oh, that was almost a success. It's always bothered me that um, intimidation is a charisma check. Lazel is, a, you know, a strong character. She should be able to intimidate based on like how hard she fights. It's never made sense to me, but that's fine. A valiant but misguided attempt. You will leave this area now. Okay. Oh, but the, we just. You know. Into the shadows. Light steps. Wow. Okay, that was that was barely a win. Secrecy above all. Better tread carefully. We're not gonna go up there again. Quiet as a mouse. Wow, we we are really bad at hiding. Okay. All right. What now? Last one. Can't risk being in the open view. I keep trying to do um a hiding. Oh god. Breathe quiet. Move with care. We may have to end up killing Bulma here. Apparently we can pick talk at her. I know she turns around, it's fine. All right, we all made it. Let's see what's down here. I assume this is going to lead to the night song. Failed perception check. What is this? Rocky crevice. Not a chance I'll fit in there. I'd have to be a lot smaller to squeeze in there. Okay, so if we had like a halfling, maybe we could we could fit in there. Is that the? Uh... Okay, so we could actually jump across there. I'm seeing on the map that there's a way to get across there. I'm not sure to what end, but we'll see. Maybe it's worth pursuing later. Now this looks intriguing. Ooh. Heck yeah, I love a good ruin and temple. Uh, it looks like we even have a puzzle. I love a good temple puzzle. Looks Investigation like failed. Can be sure does. Uh, looks like we can put all of the holes in the center here. Um, but I'm not sure if that's what we want. Okay. 
Give me, give me a minute. I, I know that's probably not what we want, but I'm, I'm still curious to try. Okay, yeah, that, that doesn't do anything. Um, all right, well, let's, uh, let's check out this whole room. Let's turn on some lights, actually. Sometimes that's all it takes. Just so. It does look like there's something over there. Also, just like wandering around means we, we have a potential chance to uh, roll an investigation check. Perception check. Failed a perception check. Everyone rolled a failed a perception check. Okay, nice. Very good, everyone. Um, tell you what, how about we roll guidance on ability checks? And we'll do it on Tav since he has the best wisdom, I think. Everyone failed their perception checks. Very good. Silver plate. I'll be taking that. Seems so simple enough. We really don't have much of any information about this place. So we have no idea what we're supposed to do. I'm just turning on, you know, candles and stuff. Might not be what we're supposed to do. Probably is not. But may as well. Can't reach. I can't reach. Um, I kind of doubt it has anything to do with anything, but I, I'll have a quick look at the uh, mark outside. This one. Hmm. No, it doesn't look like it offers anything. The same mark is above this door. I was kind of hoping if we had uh, guidance on us, it might afford us a, an extra attempt. Looks like there was a statue here. I don't know if that's anything. There's also a bunch of... There seems to be um, a star above each of the benches. Wonder if that's anything. Let's unchain everyone. This is going to be silly, but I'm going to have everyone sit at a bench. Uh, there's another bench, so we, we don't have enough people to fill all the benches. I really don't think that that is anything, but, you know, I'm just exploring options here. Oh, you know, um, this stone disc has all these runes. I'm wondering if maybe we're supposed to put all the holes on that one. That doesn't seem to be anything. And then there's always the option of it's got to have uh, no holes on it.
I'm pretty much like I'm confident enough I could I could put the holes or the the black marks wherever I want. Yeah, that's nothing either. Um Yeah. Stars like I don't I think the these match they do kind of match Except for the fact that there's it almost matches except there's only one star on the north part Hmm It was quite difficult getting here, so I'm not a huge fan of like leaving Quickly then. May as well. So I, I guess what I'm gonna do is explore this avenue over here. It's probably nothing, but I'm gonna give it a go. I don't think I can make that jump. Oh, there's a skeleton over there. We can check that out. Uh, arrow of construct slaying. Construct save, uh, slaying. Double, double damage against constructs. Wow, that's some really nice money right there. Um, I'm not seeing any way of getting over there. Like, it's not on the map. So, I don't think we can go there. <clears throat> well, the only thing we could do at this point Sorry. is um, further explore the area that that ogre was in. Which means, um, Asterion has more work for him to do. It's always a bummer when you can, like, you got somewhere really interesting and you can't really do much with it. We can't do anything with this, right? That thing is small, and I am not. Oh, we have a skeleton here I missed. Scroll of Aid. That's worth it. Like a wraith. Just like old times. Okay, so we'll hide here. There's definitely going to be something in there. Animal carcass, huh? It's not too many places um, for me to hide once I'm in there. There's something on there, though. Scroll of Burning Hands, basic potion. Check out this gilded chest. Wait, that looks really helpful. You've set foot in a restricted area. Damn it. A swift exit may be in order. Um, try to convince them you belong here. I've been sent to join the patrol. There have been reports of someone trying to sneak in. <laughs> I love that. Add bonus advantage. There we go. No, there we don't go. Nice try though. Roll again. There we go. You've been granted free passage. What you do with that privilege is up to you. Excellent. Recipe of elixir of arcane cultivation. I will definitely be taking that. I just need to uh, wait for a good moment. Nice. 
Nice. I keep pressing the wrong button. Step lightly. Perception failed, really? Dang, we just like straight up don't know what we're supposed to do down here. Just like old times. Yes, let's. Hmm. We are no longer friends. That's fine. Scroll of Milf's arrow. That's a good one. Stack of books. What happened here? On Death and Resurrection, the Illustrated Adventures of Baldoran. Histories of Faerun, Gith, and Mind Flayers. Gotta be more evidence. Oh no, are they. Did I do something bad? Not everyone subscribes to what is mine is yours, it seems. Oh shoot. An open letter on oppression and peacocks. Certainly. I'm just trying to find anything on this temple. Annals of Baldur's Gate. I'm just barely out of vision here. Oh, there's also this area, which I didn't really check out. So let's check that out. We got another basic potion. Scroll of hold person. Always nice. Yeah, I mean, I'm just like robbing these people blind. Uh, we have some chains. Can I take those? I wonder who or what those chains are for. Yeah, we really don't know, do we? We've got a candle. Some more tongs! Yo, we've got tongs. I don't think we checked out most of this room, which we will. Once, uh... Once the ogre is, is dis out of the way. A is for Azuth and other gods. Padlock key. I mean, I'll definitely take the money. Basic poison. Cabinet. Still, still trying not to get caught here. Wooden desk, stack of books. Oh no. Theft has been reported, and it seems you're the only suspect. Choose your next step wisely. Damn it. I need this person out. They are just just a huge pain in the in the butt. So I'm just going to have everyone else join the, the battle. Eager for battle. This feels good. Styrian is still, um, can he, I wonder if he can like get around her. Is he in threat? No, not 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 yet. So we can have him walk around and do a sneak attack, do you think? Must have advantage. Okay, so we gotta be hidden. Just like old times. There we go. 91% chance. Excellent. And then we're just gonna have him move away. Oh. What? Okay, excuse me. He shouldn't have been in threat range there. There's actually no reason why he should have been in threat range. 
I couldn't have hidden if I was in threat range, so I'm not sure why she gets an attack of opportunity. D&D rules will always confuse me, like on very basic fundamental levels. All right, well, whatever, it's fine. Um, we're just gonna come over with, uh, I don't think we can reach with um, Lazelle, so we're just gonna do a uh, shot. We'll do a hamstring shot. Miss. I didn't think that was going to go well. They dash so that that's their turn spent. You can knock out or flee from a temporary hostile, temporarily hostile enemy and return later. They might resent you, but they will not be actively hostile. Interesting. Um, let's do invoke duplicity. And I'm also going to try and heal Asterion. Nice. He's going to be able to do another sneak attack. No choice but to keep going. Um, let's do like a, uh, let's do inflict wounds actually. Don't waste a step. Not enough movement. So just barely not enough. Well, does that mean we can do a guiding bolt then? Target is too close. That's really annoying. <laughs> That's really annoying. Um, okay. Well, I guess we'll just do um, a lacerate. Not enough movement. We can't do it. <laughs> we can't do anything. We're just like at disadvantage for everything right now. All right. Well, I guess I'll do a heal on uh, uh, a Styrian. We could do this is a melee thing so we can't do that command move closer freeze drop to the ground let's try a command disadvantage why do we, why is sorry excuse me why is charm a ranged attack we can't do it we're at disadvantage okay i'm not gonna try can we do sacred flame okay we can do sacred flame eight damage that's pretty good Not sure why, I guess uh, the illusion could do uh, one arm strike, but we can't move them, so. What is this? Vampire Bite offers healing. Suck the blood from a living creature to regain hit points. Not if it is sleeping or if you are hiding. So we can do this. This seems kind of cool. Is this a, oh, it's a bonus action. But we need to use our bonus action. Well, we know actually we don't need to use our bonus action to, to hide Because that would mean using our vampiric bites. Let's try this invokes duplicity We gain some health back from that that's quite nice Lazel um, is gonna do a lacerate Nice they saved against the last rate, but they took 10 damage. Pulma is going to hit the illusion and also take an attack of opportunity. This is amazing. The, the, the dupe, uh, the clone has been like only a good thing every time. Um, I could do a guiding bolt, but I, I think we're close enough. No, actually a guiding bolt would still be a good idea. Let's do it. Nice. Um, yeah, let's just shoot them with it. No, I don't want to shoot them with advantage. Can we hit them? We can hit them with a guiding bolt with advantage. There we go. We're just going to chain combo guiding bolts. And then, um, we move behind them. Can we do, we can't, can't be threatened. Did, you know, sneak attack is really weird, but we have advantage, so we can still do a sneak attack. We just need to have advantage. There we go. So maybe Pulma had some something on her to help. Supply pack. No, not really. 
that's fine at least we get to explore this place with uh you know liberally um did we get to keep the stuff that Asterion stole Uh, keychain padlock key okay we don't know what that what that does yet i'm gonna grab this basic poison check out this cabinet we got elixir fire resistance potion of healing greater potion of healing salunet journal here we go most of the pages in this age journal have been hastily torn out perhaps for kindling Thus, the interlocking circles will bring the full moons to match the stars. While casting darkness where it belongs at the bottom. The ca that chasm to the dark, to the underdark will stay sealed. I confess the design is not foolproof for, to outsiders, but I had to sacrifice complexity for material resi resilience. I've always wondered why Selyun took me from the Hall of Wonders to serve at this temple as a priestess. Perhaps this was the reason. Two locking circles would bring the full moons to match the stars while casting darkness where it belongs at the bottom. Well, uh, that definitely answers a question, um, which is that, uh, you know, these are, these are moons. Full moons to match the stars. So we need one at the very top. Oh, wait a minute. Is that what these stars are for? I wonder. Hmm. Yeah, we got star 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 so i think we need hmm i'm i'm really trying to figure this one out you would think that match the stars would mean match this like symbol but it doesn't really make a lot of sense I'm really trying to figure it out. Um, it could be, well, we only have two like new moons, right? So we don't have enough new moons to like match the, that symbol completely. We also have stars. I guess those are not runes. Those are stars. So it could be that these are what I have to match up. And I think I have star, star, star. I don't know. It might also be that I have to have all of these be the same. This is probably a really simple puzzle that I'm overcomplicating, which which is classic me and also classic D and D. It's like, oh, here's a puzzle. It's really simple. You should you should uh, we should get through this in about an hour, six weeks later. God damn it. I already tried to put all of the new moons in the center. Uh, let's read that well journal again. Keep a blade 
close. Thus, interlocking circles will bring the full moons to match the stars while casting darkness where it belongs at the bottom. That chasm to the underdark will stay sealed. Oh, there's more stars here. Hold on. There's there's stars behind these candles. Stars, stars. Okay, so I, I wasn't seeing all of the stars. That certainly helps. There's no star here. There is star there. So it seems like there's darkness like here. Tell you what, why don't we do light? All right where there is where there is a star and it should make it easier to see where there should be darkness it's a good way of doing things also let's just give the room a once over to figure out where there if there are any other stars that i'm missing There's no star here, so we'll, you know, put that out. Uh, no star here. But there is a star here. It's a very little candle, but it'll have to do. Okay, so, and there's a star here, but I'm not, there's no light there that I can see. I also notice there's a, there's like light shining on this one in the center here. It seems to me that there is, there's a star everywhere, but like in this direction like in this corner um and i guess in this corner like there's one in almost every other corner i'm just i'm just trying to puzzle this out it seems to me i should almost be looking at this room in like this way I'm just trying stuff. I feel like the all of the line the new moons should be like on this line here. That almost feels like you know what we're working with here. Like, that seems right to me, but maybe I'm missing something. Because, like, there's... I'm not seeing any... I'm going to have to do a pause, because we're, we're officially at, like, this is taking too long to justify it. Um, all right, I'll do a pause, and I'll try and figure it out. And I promise I will not look up a guide, at least not yet. Who's very far down? Okay. We'll have to go in to see the bottom. I, uh, I accidentally solved it. Like, it was really stupidly simple. I was overcomplicating it. Um, I, like, I don't read this as being the bottom, but I guess just throw all of the, <laughs> all of the new moons on the, the bottom. I guess these stars had nothing to do with anything. They, they could have been just, like, red herrings. There is work to do. But anyway, we figured it this out. Way.
So we are on our way to the Underdark. Didn't mean to do this. Marked as reference material for the Temple Archive, this logbook contains transcripts of magical sendings from the temple to the depths below. This record seems to be an exchange dating from the near the temple's foundation. Jarus, enough foolishness. A new temple with settlers to guide, and you'd rather scrabble in the dark below, where clerics of Selyun act like it. Morna, the lady lights the way. What is this underdark but a path her light hasn't touched yet? Come, we can debate the theology in the new chapel. New chapel? Those materials were meant for the temple proper, not your playground down here, there. Uh, what am I to tell the house of the moon? Tell them to start packing. There are caverns down here to dwarf the inner cathedral. The builders are almost done, and so we go deeper. Enough, Initiate. The Underdark is no place for games. Those are novices with you, not silver stars. Return immediately. Initiate, don't ignore me. I know you took took ample components for ascending. Respond. Respond. M. Fortified what we can, but, but words won't last. Seal the tunnel and do not follow. You are right. This place belongs to them. Hold fast. Whatever it is, I'm sending reinforcements. Just hold on. No, no more death. Ordered novices to collapse tunnel. You're proud of... You'd be proud of them. Forgive me. We only meant to spread her light. Well, that doesn't sound good. None of that sounds very good. Ugh. Am I heading towards something dire? So long poking about down here. I'd much rather be outside with the sun on my skin. You've only just come to tolerate the sun, and you're already nostalgic. If you're going to complain the whole way, by all means, return topside. You could use the color. Well, this place, uh, we just got a journal update for Find the Night Song, so I have to imagine we're on the right track here. But is this really what we want to do? I'm not sure. But I'm going to pursue this for now. Asterion, go ahead and open those gates. Let's crack it open. We don't even... Oh, difficulty class 20. Oops. I probably needed guide. Oh, uh, it wouldn't have made a difference. Let's roll it again. Try again. Uh, it's just... Yeah, yeah, we've got tons of uh, thieves tools to spare. I'm not even gonna... Oh, let's add the bonus. It costs us nothing, so why, why not? I think that's a success. It really is quite nice having a rogue. I was talking to... I can't remember who was I talking to. Yeah, I think it was uh, my uh, mutual that was, you know... Ooh. Something over there. Who's also playing this game. Um, I, I resent rogues in a way because it's like they're, they're the, you know, Swiss army knife of D&D. Um... It just always seems like you need a rogue to do all of the things that you want to do. Oh, that's a fail, actually. It's dark around here. Would be a terrible shame to lose you forever. Yes. Do keep your wits, Shadow Heart. Should a dagger suddenly slice your neck, you may never know who's to blame. I'm rolling badly right now. Oh, that that's actually a success. Okay, I'll take it. Helmet of Smiting, Bolstering Smite. When you apply a condition with one of your smite spells, you gain temporary hit points equal to your charisma modifier. That seems like something for Tav. These have stayed interesting. Can we wear that? Yes, we can. Equip. Perfect. He looks kind of goofy with it on, but that's fine. All right, Assyrian. Waypoint discovered. Very nice. 
traps. How considerate. Okay, disarm the trap. Let's do that first. Always add guidance. It should be a success. Nice. Easy. Goblins are such vile little parasites. Given your own nature, are you really the one to judge? Very nice. Ah, just a buttload of money. Sometimes all you need is a buttload of money. Elixir of bark skin. That's quite good. I should at some point really distribute some potions. More thieves tools. Very uh, considerate of them to provide thieves tools all right. in a place I would be most likely to want to thieve. Do some thieving. Perhaps take part in a theft. Give me one second. All right. Um, so I've got tons of interesting things going on here. Ooh, there's a great sword helmet. A lever! Pull the lever. Cronk. It's never the wrong lever, you know? That, that, it, it bothers me. I hate this lever erasure, you know, propaganda. There's no wrong lever. Okay, we found a waypoint. And, uh, you know, this place is interesting. Blacksmith bellows, huh? Rotten carrot. Never, it's a terrible crime to let a good carrot go to waste, you know? Don't read into that now. Great sword, we're good. Actually, what is, uh, Lazel using right now? She is using a long sword. I wonder if she could use a great sword. She could, and it is, in fact, better. The only problem is that um, the longsword is versatile, whereas the greatsword is not. However, I think she's been two-handing her longsword long enough that it warrants using a, uh, you know, a, a greatsword. Trap disarm kit. Well, back what to Styrian. I guess I don't have to do that. I can send it to the right character, but, you know. Go ahead and turn on that brazier. I'll just help myself. Nothing but a nothing like a good brazier, you know. Step quick. Oh my goodness, this is quite the place. I did not expect this level of depth from the Underdark. In fact, I didn't even expect this game to have the Underdark. The Underdark is something I feel like, um, I mean, I haven't played the other Baldur's Gates, so please forgive me if I'm wrong about this. In fact, I haven't played a lot of D&D games. Uh oh, a Minotaur, they're already hurt. Okay. Get back. Minotaur absolutely ate it. More effort than a pit of spikes. Credit where it's due. I wonder if this is the night song. How about this? Well, I mean, like, you know, let's check out the Minotaur. Portculus. I don't care what others say about the Underdark. It's beautiful down here. I'm used to a crypt's gloom. This is something else. Uh. Ouch. 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 Get back. Okay, we're all dead. Cool. Love that for us. Cool. That's great. That's great. Uh, when was our last save? God, this game is not good about autosaves. How long ago is this? My God, that's a long time ago. Wow. 
that is a long time ago this game needs more auto saves you know like they i know that uh like someone from larian said um you're really not going to want to do quick save quick load because you're going to want to like go ahead and live with the consequences i i'm just like you know solasta was a game where every single dice roll came with an auto save because they wanted you to live with consequences i think it's kind of um a little bit of a problem that this game doesn't auto save like ever oh, look where we are we haven't even fought the ogre oh my god i'm just gonna have to do this again huh because i didn't realize that i was gonna eat shit from those things okay well i'm just gonna go ahead and do this uh i'll see you all soon as i go ahead and pick up everything again and solve the puzzle again and do all that you're not gonna you don't have to watch that but god damn okay uh pretty much back to where i was yeah i i did have to do all of that again it's fine uh, I'll, I'll do a quick save from more you know more often the, uh, now that i know um signs of life near the outpost i found a, this faded uh log book signs of life near the outpost intelligent clearly trying to hide still can't find the mysterious shapes they know how to cover their tracks possibly drow the next few entries are too faded to read blood them south rumors of a spectator there let the underdark solve its own problems no sightings no sightings minth saw statues down below shaped like drow spectators shouldn't do that either way that's one less problem to worry about potion of healing so i don't know if, well there's another faded uh, log book let's check that out well picked it up instead of uh, reading it most of this small log book is left empty. The last entry reads log 182. I was wrong. Should have paid more attention to the drow sightings. Should have known they were only a prelude. Stupid to think me ha uh, we had outsmarted them. This will be my last entry. Minth will keep the records from now on. Okay. Well, that uh, that sucks for them. But you know what really sucks? dying to your own security system that really sucks B brimmed hat this wizardly hat has a little embroidered rabbit inside its lining the rabbit is called snowball and once he was lost never to be found i kind of want to take that we have a rotten tomato we have some gladiatorial sandals got some helmets we got all kinds of stuff we don't have you know what we don't have though is answers right here's the minotaur get back more effort than a pit of spikes credit where it's due scimitar um i still have to trade I, I one thing i didn't do is to trade uh the great sword for lazel's long sword equip and we're pretty much back to where we were send this to Asterian. scroll of ray of sickness given your own nature are you really the one to judge seems to me we could go out this way objective noted but I am going to save before we do that. I don't, is a F6 save? F5? There we go. F5 is a quick save. Although quick is kind of, uh, you know, it's a, it's a pretty good word for that. Mm. Petrified drow. Wonder what petrified them. We have exploding mushrooms. What what is happening? Uh oh, I think I might know why they're petrified. I really hope it's not what I think it is, because if it is, then we are in a lot of danger. no yeah that's exactly what i was hoping it wasn't uh 
we cannot take that right now. Ouch. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, we also have a uh, a wizard we're trying to fight. Oh yeah, we can't do this. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and load. Okay, um, I don't think we should be down here yet. I was trying to find the night song, but I, I don't know if it's something we can accomplish just yet. So I think um, our next course of action is to head back to the grove. I might end it on a cliffhanger. Uh, we'll see what uh, what happens when we go back to the grove. We do have a little bit of time left and there's, you know, a little is a lot in this game when it comes to story. All right, so um, let's go to our map. Um, camp Emerald Grove. Um, I guess this is the as close as we can get. All right, I'm cool with this. One true way. We probably, you know what? Before we do this, let's do a short rest. We could really use it. Get back a couple of our things. Like we can get, a, we get our lacerate. I guess you get, yeah, you can only do this once per short rest. It's good, an interesting uh, way of doing things. We accomplished quite a lot at that goblin camp. Not as much as I was hoping for, but still quite a bit. Uh, might want to buy a few things. I will be heard. Well met. And thank you. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete. Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. I like how he says bits and bobs and then he's got like, you know, magical chain shirt, rain dancer, uh, spell thief, arcane ve vehemence. Once per short rest, you regain a spell one level one spell slot when you land a critical hit with the spell thief. Nice, but um, I, I don't, I'm not a huge fan. Burned alive, he deals an additional 1d4 or 1 to 4 slashing damage to burning targets. And of course, he's got some cabbage. Got some uh, plus one padded armor, ring mail, some arrow of acid. We should really try and um, actually optimize our, our gear a little bit. Uh, let's go to trade. And I'm going to sell some things. Um, we'll sell that for now. I'm just gonna sell our stuff and get some gold. Basic poison. Uh, Asterion probably has all of our stuff. Silver tray. I didn't pick up all the silver trays. Sell wares. There we go. So that makes that a little bit easier. We'll leave this for now. I think we have pretty okay gear for now. I, I, I wouldn't mind getting something better, but you know, we're all right. Um, Emerald Grove. I would like to try and figure out where to go next. What is that? Fil firm dirt. That's nothing for us. We do. We still have a goal over here. Defeat the goblin search for the le leaders. Search for Halson. We didn't find Halson, did we? We should probably do that. So I guess we're heading back. Oops. Um, Blighted Village. Let's just go back to the Underdark outpost and then we'll just, you know, to the shadows. go back up. I don't care what others say about the Underdark. It's beautiful down here. I'm used to All right, so we'll go back up and we'll try and find Halson. We do need to actually check that box before we leave. And it would be good to have, Hal like, you know, the leader, the actual proper leader of the grove. Um, 
before we're they're besieged by a, a goblin raid you know it'd be nice I wonder how much more difficult this game would be if I had even one person who didn't have dark vision. Like that just sounds like a nightmare, TBH. Well, we we uh, made quite a lot of progress here. I, I'm, I'm actually quite pleased. I'm glad I, did, I actually solved that puzzle without needing to look up a guide. I have to admit, I don't really understand the solution, but I know it's something really stupid and easy. Like it's it's very very simple. It's just that I you know sometimes I struggle with simple solutions. We can't make that jump, right? There's just no way. I wonder we there were like boots of long striding someone was selling at one point. I mean, there's an alternative path to get there. I don't have to do this silly thing. Everywhere I look, chasm. Everywhere I see is chasm. Chasm everywhere. Let's see what this guy has to say. Brakal. Praise his ever bleeding axe. Praise his throne of flaming iron. Praise McGlubbyet. You know McGlubbyet. A tyrannical deity who treats his goblinoid followers as slaves. Trying to interrupt my prayers? Scared of a real god? You're as goomless as the rest of them. Uh, my people build cities on the corpses of gods. Yours do does not impress me. Maybe your people can build a nice little necropolis on the carcass of this absolute joker. My own tribe's fallen for this shite. Traitorous bastards. The great absolute brings us together. Drow and gnolls and goblins all braiding one another's air. It's a load of shite. Yeah, I mean, I, uh, I kind of agree. You don't like your people mixing with outsiders. Well, okay, I, that's not the part I disagree with. I just don't believe in all this togetherness and chumminess. Ain't natural. It won't last. They'll be tearing into each other soon enough. Sodom all. I'll wait it out in air, praying to a real god. Okay. What lies within? Be wary. This place is trapped. Oh, yeah? Where? There's a stool up there. Well, um, that's interesting. <laughs> Boss Ragslin weren't lying when he said anyone could join the absolutes ranks. You are standing very close to an edge to be saying something like that. In fact, I don't think I like you. Oh, okay, never mind. Keep moving, unless you're wanting a clubbing and drop. Okay. You're either with the absolute or against her. Ain't no in between. Hmm. All right. Well, I'm I'm disappointed I couldn't push the goblin off the ledge there. Dang. You know, can't have everything, I suppose. Um, there's not really a lot left unexplored. A little bit over here. Hey, you know, I bet that, um, like, chained room below was for the, uh, for Haslin. I bet you. I bet that was very obvious, actually. I'm going the wrong way. I actually meant to go north. Ah. 
I don't know if there's more stuff there. It's fine. I don't really care. Who's this guy? Kagran. That was intense. I wouldn't want to bump into that thing while it was still alive. But goblins give you no pause? Someone needs to keep an eye on these buggers. I don't make a habit of questioning the absolute. Now quiet. Okay. Well, I don't think we've gone up here. In fact, there's another ladder that keeps going up. What do we got over here? Ooh, that's a lot of treasure. Careful, I mind. Hmm. Uh oh. Your lock picking is attracting attention. Tread carefully. Oops. Ready or not. You won't do that again. I mean, you know. There's no time to waste. Time for a boost. Someone there. She fertilize the field. I guess I guess you're not gonna move from that spot Rips now. And streets will flow with their blood. Their cities will be raised to the ground. Damn. Is he just there forever now? She is absolute. You'll sit at the table. You'll drink from her barrels. You will rain. Yeah, I got it. I, I'm just standing here near the treasure. It's fine. You don't have to be here, dude. I'm watching the treasure. Don't worry about it. You're not gonna let me. You're not gonna let me try again, are you? Do we have charm? I thought we had charm person. Hmm. We do. Ends early if you or an ally hurts the target. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, <clears throat> make a quick save here. Give me, give me a second. Only a thirty six percent, huh? If you can't behave and leave us. Let us leave and uh, leave us in peace. Well, I mean, this place will be ripe for raiding later. What do we got going on up here? Grease bottle. I'll grab that. I guess I don't know where Haslin is. I do not know that. Might find so it might be that they escaped to the underdark. Scroll with uh, was that scroll with speak undead? Is that guy finally uh, moving on? Their cities will be raised to the ground, and they'll know she is. What's uh? Absolute. Okay, there's nothing behind there. You'll sit at her table. You'll drink from her barrels. You will. Okay, I'm gonna try this one more time. We'll cast uh, Guidance on Asterion first. It'll probably give him um, a benefit to doing a hide check as well. Just, uh, just give me a moment. Okay, okay, so now we just need to open it up. I'm just gonna pick my moment here. When he walks away, I'll, I'll jump in there. 
You'll drink from our barrels. You will rain. Yeah, I, I, he doubles back. It's a little bit spooky. That's Yo, get in there. Get in there. Is that it? Is that all that's in there? Okay. Now we got to pick our moment to get out. They're both here now, so... Okay, just walk away. And they'll know. She is absolute. He doubles back, so I can't. Now is not a good time. You'll sit at her table. You'll drink from her. I'm mouth. pretty sure he looks towards it. You will no, we're good. Rain. Okay. We're good. I didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. Tempers are rising. It's clear not everything you find is at your disposal. <sighs> well, that's good. frustrating. Okay, it's fine. We're we're good. Let's leave. They don't know. I was gonna try and close the door so it'd be less obvious, but that's fine. Um, seems to me Haslin is not here. So I'm just going to head back to the grove and um, I mean, there's still a little bit here that we haven't checked out. I do want to check out everything. Yeah, there's like an extra room here that we didn't look at. I've done it. I think I've done a pretty good job of like, you know, doing the stealth thing. I'm usually really bad at stealth. Oh, I guess yeah, we can we can do this. Look at that. There's another uh moon thing. I'm sure those are hints for uh, like another puzzle maybe. Yes, please. We got a ring of poison resistance. Hey. Go ahead and equip that. Why not? I know I'm giving a lot of things to Assyrian. I'm going to we'll, we'll play, um, you know, equipment, uh, musical chairs uh, in the future. I might do it between episodes. What are we here? So what's going on here? Uh, warg pens. All these raids and especially well, there's even more stuff to do here. Oh, hey, there's a, pe a, a bear. That's got to be Haslin. Do you think it... See? It squealed. <laughs> it's it again. Keep your hands steady, three. <clears throat> again. Again. Make it squeal again. Um, what the hells are you doing? We're juicing it up. The beast came in here with those robbers, killed Dink and Mince too. Boss is thinking of serving it to the wargs. And it makes funny noises. We made it squeal. Look, look, you'll see. Give me that rock. I'll show you. Um, I'm not going to do this anymore because I feel like it's not a good idea. Um, how about a taste of your own minute? Leave him alone. What are you? Get lost if you can't stand a bit of rough housing. Throw a rock at the bear. Leave the bear to the goblin's mercy. Uh, I guess we'll do a combat in here. Yeah, this is Haslin for sure. Ooh. Hey, bear. The gods! Get the gods! Um, we gotta stop that goblin. 
we cannot allow them. We actually have some pretty good movement right here. We should be able to do a sneak attack on them. I, I really, I, I really, really wish some of the interface was just a bit better at explaining when you're in threatened or not. If I can't hide when I'm in threatened and I have to be doing sneak attacks like as much as possible, it's, it's really, really frustrating when I like literally cannot do the thing that I'm trying to do. Um, fine. Well, like whatever, but it's, it's just, it's just, it is a little bit frustrating. Um, why don't we go ahead and throw some grease on this spot here and make it a little bit harder um, We won't do a bite that does that seems like a waste Hunter's mark on cave bear. What does that mean? Oh, it means he's gonna He's a, he, that's a ranger spell. That means he's got, uh, like, advantage to, to attacking it. Is this guy's gonna disengage and try and also try and, uh, alert the guards? I really cannot allow that. Make way. So let's just do a normal attack. That's enough to kill them. And, um, I guess I'm out of movement. Which is a shame because I could do a pommel strike. Can I? Oh, I don't have enough movement. Okay. I guess uh, this is going to be a long episode because I, I really just want to like this is I don't expect this will be a long combat. Oh, we do have wargs. Maybe I should end the, uh, com the, the episode here. All right, you know, I said I promised a cliffhanger. I guess I'll deliver on that. Sorry. Sorry about that. But I'm pretty sure that this is Haslin. So um, that's a pretty big box checked there. Um, if you are enjoying this series, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.